Hey guys, hope everyone's having a great day. Uh, I've got to be a little bit quieter right now, filming at nighttime, but I uh, wanted to get this video out to you guys pretty much since Christmas Day. Um, I opened a case of 2021 Jumbo uh, Tops Update for myself for Christmas and wanted to share with you guys what I got. I'm a big fan of the product and I had a, uh, in my opinion, a very good case. So I uh, wanted to show it off, maybe give you guys an idea of what you can get out of one of these and really just show you guys what uh what cool cards i pulled you get a good mix and uh flagship usually so should be a fun one i think i'm gonna go uh worst to best in my opinion um it gets a little bit difficult with some of them but uh out of the six boxes i think four of them were pretty pretty awesome um two of them were kind of average but even in those you get some good you, you know you walk away with some good cards so I think we'll start with this one. Uh, so for my autographs, every autograph I pulled in this case, I pulled seven. And every autograph was an 86. You, there's, um, there's, you know, the baseball stars, uh, auto sticker autos. There's the uh, any of the insert kind of autos that you can get. There's the 70 years of, of tops autographs, but I didn't get any of those. I got all 1986 uh on card autos except for one but it's still an 86 auto so um you know we'll go through this i kind of separated it out by box so i've got a, a team bag here of all the um you know gold foils not numbered rookie stuff some of the insert rookie stuff i think that's a uh, silver pack kid brian so a bunch of nice stuff in there i'm pretty much gonna be showing off hits and numbered stuff and short prints um so box the first box uh the worst box in my opinion the uh a Jake Cave Gold and a Freddy Peralta Orange to $2.99. Got a uh, nice Steven Matz Black. Unfortunately, not with the Mets. That's number to 70. A yeah. uh, nice Joe Adele High Tech Rookie. Jonathan India 86 Rookie. Nice Jose Devers Rainbow Foil Rookie. And actually did get the Kirloff Debut Rainbow Foil, which is awesome. Um, hit a Carlos Hernandez gold rookie to 2021. Hit this nice Tatis short print. It's the regular, but still pretty nice picture on that. A Joey Gallo all-star sleeves, our first hit. Then we got a nice Aaron Judge relic, all-star relic. I like that a lot. Um, and then our autograph was a, a Tom Hatch rookie auto. So uh, again, not the best box. Definitely the worst of the case in my opinion, but we still got, you know, some Rainbow Foil Rookies, a uh, Aaron Judge Relic, Tati Short Prince. So um, still pretty solid overall. Um, for the second worst box, or the fifth best box, however you want to look at that. Got our uh, bag full of nice stuff. I think there's another Kid Brian on the back. Uh, we've got a Lane Thomas Advanced Stats to 300. Upside down, but you get the idea. Uh, Mikhail Franco Gold. Got a nice Casey Mize rookie debut gold. I think we got the Nick Madrigal as well, yeah. So two nice rookie debut golds in that box, um, as well as this uh, Kyle Isbell gold, or uh, sorry, green foil board to $4.99 rookie. And for our hits, we got a uh, Xander Bogarts all-star. Got a Trey Turner regular relic. None of my relics were numbered in this case, um, which I was, I was fine with. The autos were pretty solid, so. Um, was kind of hoping for a patch or something, but I think the auto is more than made up for it. Um, and for auto, we got a uh, Drew Rasmussen uh, 1986 on card rookie auto, and that's the black number to 199. Um, I looked him up, he's actually pretty solid. He was in the Willie Adamas trade, so he went to the Rays and Adamas went to the Brewers. And he, I think, he started 10 games, ended with like a four and one record and a two something ERA. So Gonna be watching him next season, uh, hanging on to that auto. I think he, you know, could be a solid uh, pickup, especially on that Rays team. They've got such a solid team right now. Uh, might be fun to, to watch him and hang on to that auto, see what happens. So now getting into the good stuff, I think I'll do this one. This is probably the fourth best box, um, but the, these next four are all pretty, you know, somewhat similar. It's hard to choose. Um, so again, big stack of good stuff. So we got a Mercedes Silver and a Gold Foil Rookie on the front. 
getting into the good stuff. Got a Sierra Gold. Um, Victor Caratini Platinum to 70. These cards look amazing in person. I love these. I wish I had a nice rookie in this parallel. Um, Andrew Vaughn Silver Pack rookie. Didn't have that yet. Nice Luis Patino. Speaking of Rays, Luis Patino uh, rookie debut. Gold. Really nice Cronenworth green foil board. That's number to 49. I have the um, true rookie green foil board that I pulled as well. So uh, got both of those, which is awesome. I have a Ben Rortvet Mother's Day. This is the, I think this is the lowest numbered parallel I hit. Um, just for the, the, you know, base cards. Uh, it was a rookie, not the best one, but that is number 250. So, uh, could be a nice one in the future. You never know. Uh, and then we got a Freddy All-Star game. Got the Javi Baez in his Cubs uni, sadly. Um... And for the auto in this one, uh, I had a couple slow rolls in this case. This first one, slow rolled, it was a Mariner. And I was like, high end, you know, plus side. We're looking at Griffey, if he's in this, I don't even know. Um, Ichiro, uh, Kellenic, Rookie Auto, uh, maybe even like an Edgar Martinez, Randy Johnson. I don't really know who's in the set. Um, slow rolled a little more, saw a helmet, and then I saw it was a red. And I was like, man, this is a low numbered auto. Uh, but then I, you know, rolled it all as Taylor Trammell, so not the best. Um, I, I figured it was probably like a 75% uh, chance it was going to be Trammell or, you know, like a Logan Gilbert auto. Um, but still, I mean, a red rookie auto. Those are number two, 25. Pretty tough pull, so that, that's, you know, fourth best box. You get a red on card auto and uh, Cronenworth, a Mother's Day rookie, so... Uh, can't not complain about that. Heading into the top three, I think we'll do this one. I hate to, I hate to put this one at three. It's so good, but I think I'm gonna have to. So, got our bag of uh, regular stuff. Looks like I've got a rainbow foil rookie right on the front, uh, and then a uh, Joey Bart high tech on the back. So, good stuff in there. Uh, and then we hit a green John Lester and an orange John Birdie. That was kind of interesting. Obviously, those are both numbered. I just don't want to say it, you know, every time. Uh, let's see. In this one, we got a uh, Andrew Vaughn, regular 86 insert rookie. Didn't have that. Got a Peter Solomon, gold rookie to 2021. Got this really sharp, really nice looking Akil Badu, gold rookie. So I have the Kellenic and the Badu golds, and they both are, you know, very well centered, very sharp corners. So excited about that pull. Uh, and then for our hits, we got a Jesse Winker All-Star Game, got a Chris Bryant All-Star Game jersey, and we had a Franklin Colome on card rookie auto for the Mets. Um, so not great hits, but our two best cards of this box were a Babe Ruth Super Short Print. So this is the uh, 27, I believe, is the serial code on this. Uh, is that right? Let me check that. Sorry, 17. So I think it's 16, 17, 18 on these uh, short prints. So super short print, Babe Ruth. Very nice card there. Um, and then uh, I posted this on my Instagram, but if you guys know, the silver packs are very difficult to hit. Color, very di even more difficult to hit autos in. I mean, especially compared to, compared to Series 1 and Series 2. Um, I know Jabs opened like a hundred plus of the silver packs on a video and didn't get a single autograph in those. And that's like, I mean, what is that? Like 10 cases worth. So, uh, I had no expectations going into this and I didn't even see it in the pack. I was just like sliding through them, pulled one off and it was just like, it, it was just there. I, I pulled a card off and it was just a redemption for a Jazz Chisholm 86 Chrome, you know, silver pack mojo auto. Uh, and those are actually number two, 149, I believe, the base ones. Uh, so super awesome card there. I redeemed it immediately. This is already uh, hopefully going to be on the way soon. So very excited about that. And that was the third best box we got. Um, I want to say it's so hard to choose, but I'm going to go, I'm going to save the card I really like for last. So we're going to go over the first box I got now. 
Got our bag with a Kellenic and a Badu insert rookie on the back, it looks like. Hit Matt Harvey Gold. And a... I can't even read that. Quintana. Sorry, the lighting's not great. Green. Um, hit a Bone Black Gold. Kirilov Silver Pack rookie. Really nice Dylan Carlson Rainbow Foil rookie debut. Love that card. Gilberto Celestino Gold rookie. Hayson Kim Orange rookie debut. A lot of rookies in this box. Kyle Cody uh, Independence Day to 76. Very nice. Uh, in the silver pack, we had a nice Alec Manoa purple rookie, and that's numbered 75 to 75. Hit a black Josh Palacios to 70 rookie. And for hits, All-Star Game Romuto. Nice All-Star Game Bobichette. And then uh, 86 Yankee on-card auto Don Mattingly. So super nice pull there. Uh, definitely going to hang on to that. Love that card. Um, very clean. Hit that in the first box. I thought it was going to be all downhill from there. Luckily it was not as you can see from the rest of these, but going into the best box here. Put it right here. Good stuff. We got an Adele Black Gold Rookie on the front. Carlson High Tech on the back. Pretty nice. Uh, color, Joe Kelly Gold, um, Blake Snell Gold, and a Brad Miller Green. Nothing crazy. Um, in this box, we hit a bunch of Kellenics. I didn't hit any Kellenics in the rest of the case. Uh, I've, I've seen this in other breaks. You get a box with a bunch of Kellenics. It's really weird. Um, but all I got in the other boxes were the regular base debuts and rookies. And in this one, I got a uh, 86 rookie insert. Didn't have it. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. Uh, like I was saying, last box, Kellenic 86 rookie insert. Uh, 86 silver pack chrome mojo. Didn't have that. And this really nice rookie debut rainbow foil. Um, so big Kellenic box. Super happy about that. Um, but then moving into the, actually, before we get to the hits, also hit this Griffey short print. So very nice. So our short prints were a uh, Tatis, Griffey, and then a Babe Ruth super short print. So very lucky on those. Um, and then for the hits, got this nice Christian Yelich with a pinstripe relic. Got a Chris Bryant black all-star game. This is our only all-star game um, parallel. This is to 199 Not terrible. Um... But then my absolute favorite card of the case, big fan of this one. I've been wanting to pull one of these autos um, for a while now. Never, I definitely didn't think I was going to do it in this product, but um, we did. And I'll show that now. I, I slow rolled it. It was the second to last box. I was like, I've already got the Don Mattingly, the Jazz Chisholm Silver Pack auto, uh, and the Tremel Red auto. Uh, so just one more big hit would absolutely, you know, blow the roof off the case. And... I slow rolled this guy, so I was the White Sox, had some uh, Matt Foster, Zach Birdie, uh, you know, flashbacks, um, kept going, saw gold, saw the face, bang, Luis Robert, gold, on card, auto, number to 50. I'm in love with this card, absolutely staying with me. Um, Big fan of Robert. He's a phenomenal player. I can't wait to see what he does when he's healthy next season. Um, super happy with this. So um, that's the case, guys. Very excited for the case. It's making me want to open another, you know, another jumbo case of every flagship product that comes out. So we'll see what happens with Series 1. Um, just thought I got a good deal on this and couldn't pass it up. And I'm very glad that I did. So uh, hope you guys all had a happy holidays. Uh, Merry Christmas. Let me know what you guys think of my case. And thanks for watching. See ya.